you said threesomes are dangerous. Mm. Are they not? Are they not e- more easily accessible or easy to talk to? With Man, women? I don't like threesomes. <laughs> I've had bad threesome experiences. She said, "I don't got you, man." Yo, wait, no, because what, what like the girl, because my I never asked for it, and like my ex had brought it. And then got mad at her friend. Like, they starting to fight. Oh, See, I go no, in the living room. Like, bro, I didn't ask for this. Like, you did this. I have you know the most success. They was playing in the middle of the pussy. What it. they was doing? <laughs> yes, they was in the, like, it was bad. And they, tell like, me, tell me. That tell was me. the only wow. time? No, I've had a few. But they have all been bad. <laughs> it just, it just. <laughs> now, nah, give us that horror story. Yeah, let, let's hear the bad Ooh, threesome with two women. I had a real horror story, except that one when they started fighting. Wait, scrap wait. Literally fighting. Yes, they was fighting in the bed. What did you do? In my, ma- in Look. my manager's bed. So I was, Wait. I, I was, I, I didn't, I didn't have no, I didn't have no, I didn't have, I was, I didn't have a house yet. I didn't have no, I was a little homeless. <laughs> oh no, bitch, you gonna tell this Wait. story. I was a little homeless. Girl. You was a little homeless and you yeah. set up a threesome in your manager bed. And, and, I t- and, and I sent the video to my manager like, yo. And he was like, Jazzy, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> I was reckless, but it was fun. It was a story. And then, no, no, tell the story. <laughs> she we brought her friend in. Uh-huh. Did you talk about it before? So, Did, no, literally. Okay. So, all right, boom. Here we go. I'm in bed. This is late. This is like, she's not from L.A. She's from, she was living in Houston at the time. And so she was out. She was out for a long time. So I'm asleep. I'm not. She comes in with her friend. Okay. Never met her friend. Don't know who she is. Bad as fuck, though. Bad. I'm like, they get in bed and they just start kissing. And I'm like, oh, shit, this is about to go. <laughs> like, nobody says nothing. Like, they're not explaining nothing to me. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's you not a job. You want this? None of that shit. <laughs> oh, my God. It's, no, it was crazy, bro. And so, like, boom. So we start. So I start kissing my girl. But where I fucked up at, I started kissing the other girl, too. Okay. And I started, But I'm thinking this is the game time. <laughs> like, we all in this together. So, <laughs> like. But what I should have did, honestly, now that I'm old, like older and more mature, I should have just let them vibe, and I should have just like probably. Oh, like, you went too hard on other. No, day. I didn't go too hard at all. It wasn't that, but to her, it was hard. Like it wasn't even that. I didn't even do nothing that crazy. You brought this bitch in the bed. Oh and God! And started kissing. So That's wait, my... how did the fight start? <laughs> Whoa! What did she say? She said, "Are you fucking serious?" Wait, got up from the kiss. You didn't even get to eat the coochie or nah, nothing. This I, is from the kiss. I think I, nah, I didn't eat, eat her out yet. I was like, we was about to, and like. She was like, are you fucking serious? Are you dumb? <laughs> to what? you. Yeah. Like, what? Then she walk out the room and now the other girl's like, yo, you said you want to do this. Da, 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 da. They go in there and they starting to like push each other. In the, it, was, it was crazy. So I go sit in the living room and I'm just like this, bro. Like, what? A, yo, y'all figure that out. Like, I'm just here. And then they figured it out and we, we finished. That shit was crazy. Like, it was a Wait, wait, wait. Crazy. Yeah. You, you, it was enough drama to send a video and then y'all ended up fucking anyway? Yeah, we did it for sure. Let's let this be a testimony. Is this the camera here? <laughs> Bitches are crazy. That As is fuck. ridiculous. But you know, you just need you I ridiculous just, too. And no, you went back and got that. Damn. I want to be. I just think she needed a, what it was was she just needed assurance. She needed assurance that I, I'm only doing this because you brought this to me. Like, you know what I'm saying? You got some nerve to bring me pussy, so, and then I gotta tell you it's I'm, so crazy. It's, it's us. I'm, yeah. I'm, listen, God shows, and I've I've had a very successful yeah. threesomes. That's dope. They've been amazing, uh, and I love it. The one where the girl started cool. crying, girl. Oh, what happened with that? And, I mean, she started crying. She so basically, we met these bitches. We didn't even ask for it. She fuck? basically went up to my dude and like, oh my god, you look like Lenny Kravitz and Tracy Chapman. And I was like, this is crazy. Bro, let me see your nigga. Dog. <laughs> he don't look like Tracy Chapman. <laughs> Tracy, she's just a pretty nigga, and I don't like when bitches Tracy say it. Chapman. And Cause she's gay. Go, let me see who Tracy Chapman and is. Lenny Kravitz. I don't think I know. Oh, okay, okay, I can see. You see it? <laughs> that you can see it. Tracy Chapman. Let, me look, let me look up Tracy Chapman. Hold on. <laughs> I can see it. Damn, she. Oh, really that's crazy. She really. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. That's Tracy actually Chapman, funny. They got the same line. That is funny. So, and, and you know, white bitches too. Like, oh my God, you look like him. So the girlfriend oh, and her going back God. and forth. So she, she want to fuck. The femme girl wants to fuck him. The uh, the butch. And I say that because white people want to fuck me. That's so hilarious. it was their idea. Bro, yeah. we met them for 10 minutes. Yeah. By the time we got back to their crib, I'm scissoring. And I ain't had pussy in a minute. So I'm going hard. <laughs> then he get in there and I see the. The other bit, the bush bitch, go in the bathroom. I'm like, let me go check on her, bro. Because why you just like jump out this bitch? This nigga's just, I mean, it's like, oh, you're just pussy. 
I go in the bathroom. I'm like, you're okay. I'm fine. I'm fine. I just, I asked for it. And I mean, this is the reality I'm in. And you can just hear them moaning in the back. And <laughs> yeah, I, oh, he was going, he was, he was bro, still going in. Then I go over it. to him to stop. I don't even said, know what Damn. I would do if I got in this Damn. situation. Bro, I don't think people know what to do. It, safe, words, a, safe words. Safe words. Okay, man, but I, go, they I know safe pressed. words, but even in your case, they they ended up in your bed and yeah. there was no prior conversation. There was no That's prior my thing to me. If you're going to even consider a threesome and for anyone that just wants to even surprise their partner with it, there has to be a conversation leading into it about yeah. how it would happen. Yeah. We have what to are the all ways? have these scenarios. You just scenario. Right. We have to talk about it at dinners. Oh, the I fact that you, those I... two women never discussed that, we were such a safe uh, couple because we were straight and on vacation. Oh, I ain't going to hold you. Right now in my mind, I want an MMF. And so I'm trying to like drop Hints to be like, now what if I just invited two niggas that I fuck to the bar? They start talking about sports. Ooh, that's a dream. I kiss one, kiss the other, and I'll be like, y'all should both, y'all, y'all cool. Uh, yeah, that's a train. No, it's not. You are too toxic. <laughs> that is not what that is. She is. It's me setting up a threesome. Um, mm, I wanted to, right. I wanted to ask you though, choo, um, choo. because of your album, <laughs> stop it, make me laugh. Uh, free game for niggas. Mm -hmm. What three things do you feel like women do better in dating than men? Man, communication. Okay. I work, well, I think, yeah, because um, even me, this is the best I've ever been with communicating with somebody. Mm. But communication, I think, um, transparency. Yeah, um, these niggas don't be transparent. Transparent and just being also emotionally, like, sound, too. I think one thing, like, Women are not perfect. That's what I be trying to tell, like, sh girls who, like, sh think that I'm going to be, like, better than a nigga. I'm not better than a nigga. Like, this is not what this is. It's just that when I mess up and when a guy mess up, I probably, I take accountability and I know, or I know what is wrong and right. Like, and I'm using sensible, like, It's a little my better, mind. though. <laughs> it is. Mainly because the yeah. main issue that we have in no, it is a relationship sure. is that men aren't considerate enough. Yeah, mm. exactly. And so that accountability is consideration. Accountability, Men right. mature at a slower pace than we do, so you're kind of lucky with that. But I will say, there is one thing that I will say in my straight relationships hadn't really been an issue. The emotional instability. It was very hard to read when she was upset. Mm. I didn't understand what I was doing to her. Men were very direct in letting me know when what I had made them upset. Huh? What was her song? Taurus. And my nigga now is still Taurus. Ugh. That's crazy. Pisces and Taurus are a really good match. I don't know what any of them. What are you? I'm an Aquarius. Oh, okay. I, I don't know what out of me, but my ex is an Aquarius. Hate him. <laughs> January, February. Don't know a January one. Oh, yeah. All that, I know is so that nigga wasn't shit. Like, so look, I don't know damn. signs, but, but now Aquarius, but you a woman, damn. so it's different. So I'm going to let you rock. Exactly. Yeah, girls do want you but to I, figure out why they're upset. Yeah, it's so I funny. Know. I won't lean into horse but, but as soon as I hear Aquarius. Wait, what's yeah. your sign, punk? Libra, only the best sign. Oh, Lord. Balance scale over here. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> a mess. A mess. That's right. a lie. You all got you me, know, motherfucker. Um, no. Libras think they got it figured out. And do do we have whole mail or can I pose one? Ooh, whole mail. Ooh, I like that. That's. Sexy. I mean, if you want to ask one, we do have whole mail, but you can ask one and then uh, I'll take the one. Women are constantly asking us. Okay. Never dated a woman for the first time. Mm -hmm. How do I approach? Where do I get started? I said, I think you need to download the app. Start Christians playing. mingle. Not Christian. Christian Don't get God Christians God mingle. And freak. That's right. God fear and freak. Christians mingle. I need a goddamn. Now, you know Christians don't God like you. the gays. Come on now. Yeah, how do the girls start it off for the first time? <laughs> what you mean? Like, how do they. Did I say how do Christians start it off? No, how do no, lesbians start it off? Oh, yeah. How does a girl who Not just wanted to explore. <laughs> Sorry. I feel like this is the. The, the Pride edition, and y'all just bring Jazzy on a Pride edition of, <laughs> of horse, right. horse decisions. <laughs> Horror, and I said, you know what? Oh, oh, this is, oh, this Pride week. Oh, let's, we know who to get. You said. Ain't never was, got me no other time. Hold on, don't do this. No other Pride. No episode ain't even dropping in Pride Month, bitch. No, we don't uh, live here. All right. That sounds good. Help these hoes. Hell. 